feels so good after a flight. We just got home and I'm gonna take a nice hot shower. So I just got out of the shower, that felt so good. Normally I don't like to go to sleep with wet hair, but you know, after you're done flying, you feel really gross. You just wanna get like all the plain juices off of you. So my mom got me this stuff. It's called Deep Sleep Pillow Spray. I guess my mom uses this all the time. So I'm gonna spray it on the pillow. Ooh, it, it kind of smells like, it smells like eucalyptus. Look at why he's like, what was that? When you go on vacation, you go on a trip, make sure you make your bed before you go away. I know sometimes you wanna skip that step. Trust me, when you get home, you'll be so happy that you're coming home to a nice made bed. So I'm gonna sleep. We've been up since 4.50. I'm gonna get some rest and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Good night. Hey guys, good morning. So Jared just made me, what is going on with my garbage over there? I don't know who put that on top of the toilet, but anyways, um, good morning guys. Jared just made me some coffee and we're gonna go walk the dogs. But when I get back, I have two new challenges that we're gonna take on together. Well, anybody that wants to do it with me, if not, then I'm doing it by myself. So we just got done walking the dogs, having our coffee, and now we're in my garage because we are about to go to Whole Foods. Whoa, is that the mail? Oh my God, you guys have to see how much mail, how much mail we have in two weeks. Okay, so Jared's inside putting away the important mail and then some mail was for my neighbors that he's gonna go run to their house, he's so cute. So I'm gonna be doing two challenges this month. So you guys know I've been on the celery juice kick, so I'm gonna keep up with that. So that's definitely one thing that I wanna keep up with, keep, keep doing it every week because I think it's important for me to have those vitamins and minerals, especially being plant-based. I think celery is one of those that it seems so simple, but you're like, wow, celery has a lot of good stuff in it. As far as my challenge this month goes, so I was planning on doing a smoothie challenge and I was like okay I'm gonna have this smoothie every single day for a month so that I can see what happens that's the first challenge it's gonna be a smoothie every single day for a month however it's going to be a specific smoothie so we're actually on the way to the grocery store now well when we leave my garage um, and I'm gonna get the ingredients that way you guys know the exact smoothie recipe I'm gonna be making every day for a month but then the next challenge that kind of came to me this morning I was not planning on doing this woke up and my ends just feel like straw I decided this month and this is going to be the real challenge for me. Wow, I love LA. I'm so happy to be home. Hi! We're back! I know! I was like, I hope they didn't leave. It, no. feel, it feels so warm now. Yeah, yeah we did. it was fun. We were in New York. So, this is the real challenge. I'm not going to be using hot tools on my hair for a month. Ah! Like, I don't know how I'm going to do it. Well, you can do a nice wet look. <laughs> An updo. Just put it up. Like a like very bun. like prom updo. Yeah, or a messy bun. Jared's favorite look is a messy bun. I can't wait to report what happens after not using hot tools on my hair for a month. Here is my celery juice, and these lemons I got at the grocery store. I'm not putting these in there, but how big and beautiful are they? They're just like so aesthetically pleasing. We just picked this from our tree. It smells so good. We didn't even need to get those two lemons. We had one. What do you think, sis? Are you happy to be home, cutie? I love California. Oh. Hi, buddy. Hey guys, so it is dark already. <laughs> now we are on our way to yoga. So something I want to do in 2019 is get into yoga. Actually commit, you know, do it for 30 days and then make a decision if it's for me or not. Excited. Yeah, we're excited. We're gonna commit to it and we're doing a night class. So I think that might be nice too. We could put you in a nice deep relaxation. Zen. So we just got out and it was a very hot class, except it wasn't hot yoga, it was just a very warm room and warm floors and 
Jared, I'm so happy. Loved it. It's like that feeling after sex. <laughs> Hi guys, good morning. So it is 5.30 in the morning. Um, it's been a lot easier waking up early because we've been on New York time. So here I'm like, oh yeah, I'm a rock star waking up at 5.30. Meanwhile, that's like 8.30 there, but I'm gonna, not complaining, I'm gonna stick with it. So um, this is the workout outfit of the day. So this is from Lululemon. The pants are from Outdoor Voices. Feels super girly. I'm gonna put a scrunchie in my hair. <laughs> training today me and Paulina we she killed it I took a lot of breaks I just took a shower I'm now going to make my smoothie that I was telling you guys about the challenge that I'm going to be doing for the entire month you can change out the fruit but the base is the most important having the veggies having the spirulina having the chia seeds just because all of those things, especially if you are vegan or plant-based, even if you're not, these supplements are really good because you don't always wanna be worried about like, okay, did I have fish this week? You know, spirulina kind of takes care of that. Did you have your omegas? You know, chia seeds takes care of that. So I just feel like it's just a really great way to eat very balanced in something so simple like a smoothie. Hey guys, so we are on our way to go meet up with a brand. They are in town and they're like, where do you wanna meet up? I know, like so casual, it's raining today in LA. So I feel bad the day they come to visit, I mean, at least the sun's up, but the day they come to visit, it's raining. So I originally wanted to take them around West Hollywood and like go to the trendier spots and just kind of like walk around Melrose Place. So we're gonna go to my favorite bowl place and get smoothie bowls. <laughs> What do you say? Is that nice? a nice feel? It is. Would you recommend this for upper back pain? Or is there a different type of feet? Like, what's the difference? Well, this is a medium firm. Medium firm is for every type of sleeper. Okay. If you sleep on your side, try it on your side. Start on my side, and then I move to my back. She's not much of a sleeper in general. She's like a mover. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I don't like my bed. So this one doesn't have the cool in it? No, it will come with this cover. Natural, this is the ultra soft. Yeah, that's not for somebody with back me. No. I researched all this. This will be too soft for you. Yeah, like it, this hurts. This is what our mattress feels like. So with this cover, the yeah, mattress Yeah, like your butt's cold on this. Oh, I'm so excited. Jared has sticker shock. <laughs> <laughs> This 
is the first night in the new bed. I'm gonna let you guys know how it goes. It's good morning, so I just had my celery juice and now I'm gonna go in the kitchen. I'm gonna have some bulletproof coffee because we don't have any uh, coffee creamer, so we're, I'm just gonna make bulletproof coffee, which is basically adding coconut oil in your coffee, blend it up. You can add anything else in there too, like sugar or honey, anything to sweeten it, but I'm just gonna drink it just plain. Hey guys, so it's actually Sunday. This is when I'm uploading today's video, so we're kind of in real time right now, but I got a few packages, so I just wanted to show you what I got. So I got a ton of mason jars, and I got these mason jars, these ones that look like this. I think I'm gonna start pre-making celery juice and then other juices and then seal it tight because a lot of you guys were saying that it's okay to pre-juice pre as long as you put it in a seal tight container right away and then you put it in the fridge. Maybe not the celery juice. Maybe that will keep prepping in the morning, but some of the other juices we make, we're gonna put in here. And last night we did just a little grocery haul and I found this. I haven't even tried it yet, but it says, Go Raw Sprouted Granola. I mentioned on my Instagram story yesterday that I really want to stay away from soy. And the thing is, for me, it's like, okay, tofu has soy in it, tempeh has soy in it. Those are like easy things for me to know. Okay, stay away from those. And then certain protein powders have soy in them. I never realized that soy can be hidden in things like granola bars or even things like granola. So this one does say that it's dairy-free, nut-free, vegan certified gluten-free, soy-free, organic, and the flavor is apple crisp. We'll open it right now and I'll tell you how it is. Oh, it's yummy. And so I plan to have like a little fruit yogurt mix. So what I'll do is I bought some blueberries and raspberries granola, and then I found this coconut yogurt. It says living coconut yogurt with billions of probiotics. The top is kind of creepy. It says I'm alive, shake me up and carefully open. That's creepy. It's a coconut yogurt and it has ginger and turmeric in it. I also want to start eating a lot more turmeric. And last but not least, I want to talk about the new uploading schedule. So I did talk about this on my Instagram story and I completely forgot to put it in this vlog, but I am going to change my uploading schedule to Sundays like today and Wednesday. And the reason being, I did explain this on my Instagram story, but the reason being is because a lot of you guys are requesting longer vlogs or vlogs where I show more things like I tried celery juice for a week you know those things I'm able to try more of these healthy kicks and habits and try new things or a celebrity diet for a week if I have more time to film them. I'm going to be getting good content but it's just going to be longer better let me know in the comments down below what you think and also let me know what you want to see this week so have a fabulous Sunday and a great week and I will see you guys soon bye